Hey, welcome everyone. We're here, uh, Jeff from Acme Live Scan and Notary. Uh, we're here uh, with Joyce from Hello. Convenient, Convenient Live Scan and Notary. And we're here sharing some information about fingerprint scanners that we can use, that we're using. And we wanted to do a comparison on the timing that it takes to uh, collect some of these fingerprints on each of these different devices that we use. Start. Okay. 6.10 seconds. Okay. Start. Not yet. Not yet. It's not working. No, we're done. It's okay. It's just stop, stop it. And, oh, it, yeah, it did it, capture. Yeah, it did. It started over. Oh. Here we go. I didn't, re okay, I didn't even know it, it started it. Let me go ahead and go. 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 Okay. Yeah. 1.31. Okay. 3.45. I actually let it, I think it's actually one second slower, but it, um, I didn't stop in time. But okay. Still. Do you want to do the fours here? Yeah. Okay. Fours. Okay. Ready? Go. Okay. 9.53. Ready. Go. Yep, stop. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretty much the same. Wait, I'm ready. Go. Four point four. Okay. So through our scientific <laughs> experiment here, we knew, found out something we already knew, that the patrol HID is faster. But this is with a person not having any assistance from the technician. So adding that kind of speeds up the process a little bit. What do you think about that? Yes, Okay. that's true. Yeah, so if the technician's doing you know, guiding the person, it will be a little faster. I don't know if it's going to be much faster on these two devices because of the technology. Uh, just because, you know, the way it's running electricity through your hand, this one's using light. So the light one is a lot faster than the ones that running electricity through your hand. Okay. So it's important. The speed is important if you um, plan on doing groups, because if you're doing 20, 30 people, all those seconds add up to minutes and hours and people waiting in line, frustration. So um, if you plan on doing groups, you definitely want the scanner that's going to be the fastest. Um, but I do have to mention that this machine here, I, I used it for about six years and it served its purpose. I had to work a little bit harder to get the fingerprints. And that's going to be another video that we're going to show you how we get fingerprints when we were challenged with um, low quality ridges. That's it. Great. Thanks, Joyce. You're welcome. And just to let, to follow up a little bit, this is the 5.0, which... I've been using for about three years, almost three years. And so out of the three, we figured that the time, so this is the one that takes the longest to capture prints than the code, Kojak. Yeah, Kojak. And then the patrol is the fastest. So uh, this one's a little bit more for uh, mobile. I mean, you know, it's smaller, more compact, but like Joyce says, if you're doing groups of people, you'll want, 
a machine that's going to capture the prints a lot faster. We should probably also mention that these all come from the same company. We both, um, the software is the same. All the machines were purchased through the same company. Um, I know um, I still call them or refer to them as G2 Solutions, but I know they have another name that- um, Oh, we're doing me. Yeah, okay. we're talking about you, Joyce. Okay. You're gonna t t tell, tell about what we're gonna do for the next video. Okay. So our next video, um, this last video or the video you're about to see, it's gonna demonstrate our three machines we, we have and the speed without assistance from a technician. The next video we're going to do is going to show you the same machines with assistance. Sometimes we use potions, sometimes we massage, and that helps increase the time or um, faster lifespan, what it relates to. So um, that's it. That's cool, potions, mm -hmm. nice. <laughs> potions. <laughs>